Okay, so we're at Wooden Man Muay Thai and we moved into a new location and we are in the process of building out this gym. And it's a little tricky because we're dealing with, um, we're trying to stay a little bit operational, a little bit functional. We need to train our fight team and yet we still need to figure things out. So it's a daily struggle to like wait for the class to get done, to move the mats and you know, I have this whole plan for everything and then you get in here and you're actually using the space and everything changes. So it's a matter of finding like the best lighting, the best pathway, uh, the best use of space, how you're gonna get the most use out of your space. Uh, it's, you know, it's a little bit of a challenge. Where's the nap room gonna be for the trainers? It's always, always to be considered. I started training and you know, you go, you visit gyms, you go to places, and there's, you know, there wasn't a lot of communication. Um, there wasn't a lot of explanation. There wasn't a lot of sort of, I had to figure out my path, and I had to figure out how to train, and how to train for a fight, and how to, I had to figure things out, you know, a lot on my own. And so, in creating Wooden Man Muay Thai, we wanted to sort of, change things up a little bit and you know be open to everyone to be encouraging and to be warm and to greet people so that they feel comfortable when they walk into you know an intimidating sort of space um, and then to also continue that and explain to people who want to fight the process and things they need to do and, and goals to set for themselves and all the things that I had to sort of figure out on my own I want to go ahead and turn around and um, make that path a little bit easier for the new members coming up. On this path uh, of sort of making everything inclusive and, and helping, you know, teach the, the newer generation all the things that I had to figure out on my own, uh, the classes that I teach here are specifically for women. Uh, it's a women's sparring class, so it's a, it's a advanced level class. And what it does is, though they're required to, you know, train with everyone, this is a little separate area where they can train with um, people that are the same size. Uh, we can go, through, go over all the details of technique um, and have a space, a good space, a comfortable, comfortable like safe space for uh, the women to uh, get their basic techniques down. Technically, I think it's a little different than you know a regular level two sparring class here is because um, I want to take the time. The classes are smaller. Uh, we take the time to address individual needs and weaknesses and strengths. Uh, we talk about, uh, we communicate with all the members about, you know, things that they could be doing to improve, things to, if they want to fight, what they need to do to, you know, start on that path. And um, I think the class is a little bit more focused. It's a, uh, and it feels a little bit more, more welcome for the beginning sparring person, woman, you know, who doesn't necessarily, who feels a little bit intimidated having to learn how to uh, practice with a 180 pound guy. Like, it's just a little bit more understanding. Um, so you can follow us at woodenmanmuaythai.com uh, or, you know, find us on Instagram. We're out there. And I, you know, as much as I am the behind the scenes here, you know, Jongsan is the face and he is the brains and he is the man out there putting his heart into all this. So I just built the structure. He does all the, the, good, the good stuff. Subscribe and share.